Google Meet lets you convey information and emotion with video, audio, shared screens, and chat. But video conferencing can be tiring, in part because you're presented with so many different moving images in different settings. As an alternative, try audio-only conferencing with Google Meet. An audio-only meeting requires less bandwidth than video, and people who move around during an audio-only meeting won't cause a visual distraction. To use Google Meet for audio-only conferencing, participants just need to turn video off. When everyone turns video off, you're in something like a conference call. But it's actually a bit better because people may still chat. That means you can share a comment in chat without interrupting the person speaking. People also may enable live captions, which display auto-translated text as people speak. Additionally, people who might be on the go or who simply prefer to move around may choose to call in to Google Meet from a phone. For a few other ways to use Google Meet audio-only style, see my article at techrepublic.com. Of course, the most important skill to master when you use Google Meet, or any sort of video conferencing system really, is mute. With video off and mute enabled, no one needs to know that you've stepped into the kitchen for a bit of a break. If you've used Google Meet audio only, let me know what your experience has been, either in the comments or on Twitter. I'm Andy Wolber, at AWolber on Twitter, for Tech Republic.